Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's Leah from Thrifted Nest, and in this video, I'm going to show you how I refinished a fake wood nightstand using gel stain and paint. Here's the nightstand before. I bought it for $10 at a garage sale. It's not real wood, it's laminate, but I still wanted to give it the wood look. For this project, I used furniture cleaner, gel stain, sandpaper, primer, white latex paint, a paintbrush, and a tack cloth. All of the products are listed in the description below. I started by sanding the entire nightstand with 100 grit sandpaper. Laminate is very smooth, so sanding will help the paint stick. Using Crud Cutter, I cleaned the nightstand really well. I chose to use gel stain in dark walnut to give the drawers a wood look. Gel stain sits on the surface instead of soaking in like traditional stain. The consistency of the gel stain is very thick and goopy almost like jelly, but don't worry, it's supposed to look like that. Using a cheap foam brush, I started applying the gel stain. I'd get a large amount on my brush and start working it across the drawer using long strokes to mimic the look of wood grain. Don't be afraid to play around with the stain to get the look you want. I experimented with adding more and when it was too thick, I did dry brushing to get off the excess. I wanted the body of the nightstand to be a crisp white, so I primed with a stain blocking primer to stop any possible bleed through. After that dried, I sanded lightly with 220 grit sandpaper to smooth out any brush strokes. Then I applied the white latex paint using a high quality paintbrush. The nightstand needed two coats to cover completely. I unscrewed the legs. They looked like they had some kind of brown paint on them, so I sanded that off using 150 grit sandpaper. The legs underneath looked like they could have been a thin layer of real wood, but since I was using gel stain, it doesn't matter what the material is. The gel stain will work either way. I applied the gel stain on all four legs the same way I did on the drawers, creating a light, thin coat underneath that still shows off the wood grain. After that, the makeover was complete. Here's the before one more time, and here's the after. Thanks for watching. I hope this encourages you to give gel stain a try if you've been on the fence about it. Let me know in the comments below what you think and make sure to hit subscribe if you enjoyed this video. See you next project.